Oh, you haven't seen uh, it before? No, I'm not. I'm tempted to go and try this now. Yeah? And Fantastic. In some form, it, will, it has to appear. So you'll find some inspiration yeah. from the humble North Karnataka Jolada Roti yeah. made by Ravi Ganachari here Hi. at Basmeshwar Ganagli and you'll probably find uh, some avatar of it in London. Yeah. So today I'm on my way to meet a friend after many many years. Our relationship began as that of colleagues because we worked together and since then this friend of mine has moved to London and has won numerous accolades for himself also while he was here, most notably being a Michelin star for his restaurant in London. The restaurant is called Koilon and my friend's name is Chef A.V. Sriram. I'm meeting him after years, so I thought I'd carry my camera along and hopefully capture some of my conversation with him for the purpose of sharing with you. So how are you Krabha? I'm doing well. So that's long time. Chef Sriram. Hi. We used to work together here how many years ago? Huh? 95 I think 95 and of course this place has changed completely huh? Do you yeah. Did you recognize it no, when you walked no. in? No, I was pleasantly huh? surprised it's not Looking nice, smart, young Smart, young yeah. We're of course getting older but the <laughs> places that we worked in are looking younger So Chef Sriram is also the core team that built I think one of India's finest restaurant brands which is Karavli uh, 30 yes. years and it's still going strong 99 I moved to London 99? It's 23 years? Yeah, long time <laughs> My goodness 23 years, I can't believe it Sri Ram <laughs> When I can't <laughs> And uh, of course he moved with the Taj to London and is still with the Taj And uh, of course uh, I think the first Michelin star for the Taj restaurants yes. which is at Koilon Yes How is Koilon doing? We have held the Michelin for 15 years now 15 years? What I'm very pleased about is that Southern Indian food uh, You know we could bring it to the world map and people are looking at it And I think there is a lot more opportunity like the lunch place that you suggested uh, Are the kind of things that are so much more that they can do I think we are a bit uh, sh shy, we are a bit uh, meek about uh, uh, taking the credit of what it is uh. Uh, I think I wish I could see more of them happening you know I thought when we opened I'll see a lot more in the UK I'll see a lot more even in India I see but I don't see as many as I would love to there is opportunity to open maybe a hundred more hundred more yeah that is the kind of opportunity that cuisine has beauty of this cuisine is it inherently caters to what People are looking for, you uh. want light, no cream, no butter, uh. you want more of vegetable, more fish and seafood, it millet, so it, it gives everything so naturally, so it's it's ready to be served to the world. The success of Quilon is the success of Karavali is what created success, right? Karavali is almost like a, a laboratory mm. to do West Coast cuisine in the sense that when we did, when we began, it did not do as well, we learned mm. a lot from our mistake. Mm. We corrected. I mean, everybody forgot that it took us two years to get it right. We had two years of empty Karavli. That's so hard to believe now. <laughs> when you walk into Karavli, you can never walk into Karavli and expect to be seated right away because, especially if you've not made a reservation. Yeah. Uh, but two years, the restaurant didn't have customers. No. Uh, and after all the effort, I mean, tell us about the effort that went into creating it, getting those recipes. Yeah, so uh, Bern Bernadette Pinto and me, we passed out of getting school, we did our masters and then uh, I started from Kerala and she started from Goa because she's from Goa and I'm from Kerala and we did the entire coast and the rule was not to learn from any restaurant so we learned from housewives, wedding cooks, all kinds of that were for home cooking anybody could teach us and we documented those, we bought it back and we also recruited cooks and chefs who had not worked in five star hotels and all that. They were all like either home cooks, they were cooks in small restaurants and stuff like that and we trained them in-house the way 
the masala was ground or the way we cooked and also we started cooking on wood fire and doing it in in earthen pots in urlis there was a lot of work that went into understand so when you look at spaces like karavli and you look at the success that they have we forget that it's built on the bedrock of some serious work absolutely that's gone into it and like shriram says i think there is so much in so much richness in our local cuisines that we need to celebrate it we need to seek we need to explore and then celebrate it yeah, right yeah, yeah. and and i think you know if they do it right uh, uh, they have to succeed they have to just get focused they have to be sincere about it the ingredients have to be right and you know kripal we used to get our coconuts from kundapur yes. all the way because you know that was the right coconut it had to be 6 to 8 weeks and then you know our bedge chili came from bedge and so we got into that kind of detail right i mean once you get you know kane fish had to come from mangalore correct that we out of a certain size our crabs had to come from calicut we used to get somebody coming with the crabs to for us so those that is i, I remember stuff. i think we used to tell then for a crab to make it to karavli kitchen it had to literally walk into the kitchen <laughs> yes. Be alive yes right <laughs> yeah so you couldn't have a dead crab the crab had to literally walk into the karavli kitchen <laughs> uh? true true and so that's what takes yeah. that's what makes great brands yeah. i think we owe it to our own cuisine we owe it to our country we owe it to ourselves uh. it will be a shame to let our wonderful beautiful cuisine just going away dying away you know uh, it's it will be sad I, i think it requires a lot of urgent work i say this myself you know i always took for example learning from my parents for granted and uh. from kerala i would have lost at least 100 recipes not learning from them which uh. now i'm asking all my cousins and aunts and everybody and some of them i can't get them at all so i'm just saying how you lose them is yeah. so quick you don't even yeah. realize it's like i mean we have all these heirlooms all these treasures absolutely and they are lying in our homes they are in our kitchens they are in our backyard quite literally but we go all over trying to seek something that is not ours okay. and i think the kind of connect that you will have with your own cuisine which is your palate which is of course also goes back to your genes yep. goes back to your ancestry i don't think anybody can understand it as well for those of you who follow our work on food lovers tv and also here you know that i'm very passionate about the jowar roti uta and so shriram of course tried it how many years ago uh maybe 20 years ago 20 years no, ago no 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 sorry sorry maybe 27 28 years ago. 28 years ago so we got to reintroduce him to the joys of a good jowar roti uta and at a place called basaveshwar karavli here we're going to go to anand rao circle sishadri puram and uh, the ancestry of this place goes back to 67 oh, wow. when it was first established in dharwad oh, so it's the family that runs it and so we are also going to meet one of the brothers and uh, oh, fantastic very exciting take a look at what's happening so let's go with chef shri ram to basaveshwar karavli here thank you ಸಿಂಪಲ್ ಜನರು ಇವರು ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ರವಿ ಗನಚಾರಿ So his father began Basaveshwar Khanavli in 1967, in ah, Dharwad, in Dharwad. Dharwad. So the family comes from Dharwad, Dharwad Hubli. And even there's two other restaurants. I was told that there are 15 restaurants. 15 restaurants. Wow. In Bangalore, there are 8 restaurants. Ah. You want to take a look at what, what's being cooked inside? Yeah, it'll be lovely. Not bad. Why? Jolada roti yalla. He cooks. Ah. He would have come in the morning. He would have done all the cooking. and now he will be out there ready to meet customers that's the way so their brother is two brothers there you now nalku jana brothers nalku jana so there are four brothers and all of them cook ha ah, all of them cook everybody cook so they will cook so there will be a different outlet pain is ivattu ivattu padne kai anagai padne kai anagai ide so this is a this is a bedrock of a north karnataka i was about to say ivattu green piece madidevi green piece sir watani ಮಾಡಬೇಕಾಗುತ್ತೆ ಸ್ಮೆಲ್ ಬಂದ್ಬಿಡುತ್ತೆ ಒಂದ್ಸಲ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ನಾ
So if you can temperature control, you can avoid. But when you do it in natural, I completely understand you. You know what, Tripal, I'm so impressed with this. Oh. We were talking about this too much of masala, garam masala, all that. It is spiced so right, so right. The sweetening is so right. This is what the cuisine is all about, the subtlety. And it reflects that. This is like what you would eat in somebody's home. Oh. It, it is exactly like that. It's really nice. Just right. You can feel the cardamom. I mean, you can the flavor. It's just there. The cardamom is barely a whisper. Yeah, exactly. Huh? That's what it is. And that's how it should be. But the flavor is of the gram. Exactly. Huh? Because that is a hero, right? In this. Mm. And uh, because cardamom gives you the sweet flavor, that's why you add cardamom. So it's supposed to enhance the experience of eating a dessert. Not cloud it completely. Exactly. So that is the beauty. Bada chana ke the. Vishi nirali, ye ka hit tak te sir. Idhar na jawar jawar hit tak te. Bere nila, bari jawar idhar. Bari jawar idhar. So idhar na na wo vishi nirali, kudi nirali, jige mat. ಗಂಟಾಗಿಬಿಡುತ್ತೆ ಜಿಗಿ ಬರುತ್ತೆ ಗಮ್ಮು ಜಿಗಿ ಬರುತ್ತೆ ಸೊ ರೊಟ್ಟಿ ಹರಿಯಲ್ಲ ಅದ್ರಲ್ಲಿ ಯಾವ್ದು ಆಯಿಲ್ ಕಂಟೆಂಟ್ ಇರಲ್ಲ ಇದು ನೀರ್ ಮತ್ತೆ ಇದು ಎಷ್ಟು ಆಗ್ತೀರಾ ಇದು ಹತ್ತು ಲೀಟರ್ ಈಗ ನೀರು ಒನ್ ಲೀಟರ್ ಹೋಗುತ್ತೆ ಇದಕ್ಕೆ ಮತ್ತೆ ಈಗ ಇನ್ನೊಂದು ಒನ್ ಲೀಟರ್ ನೀರು ಕೋಲ್ಡ್ ಕೋಲ್ಡ್ ವಾಟರ್ ಒನ್ ಲೀಟರ್ ನೀರು ಹೋಗುತ್ತೆ ಟೆನ್ ಲೀಟರ್ ನೀರಿಗೆ ಏಟ್ ಕಿಲೋಸ್ ಏಟ್ ಲಾರ್ ಸೊ ಅದು ಗಟ್ಟಿ ಮಾಡಿ ಆಮೇಲೆ ಆಮೇಲೆ ಹಾಫ್ ಅನ್ ಅವರ್ ರೆಸ್ಟ್ ಮ
ಆಮೇಲೆ ಹಿಟ್ ಮಿಕ್ಸಿಂಗ್ ಹೋಗೋವಾಗ ಸೊ ಒನ್ ಕೆ ಒನ್ ಕೆ ಜಿ ಹಿಟ್ಟಿಗೆ ಒನ್ ಕೆ ಜಿ ಇದು ಜಿಗಿ ಜಿಗಿ ಮತ್ತೆ ಒನ್ ಲೀಟರ್ ವಾಟರ್ ಒನ್ ಲೀಟರ್ ವಾಟರ್ ಅದು ನೋಡ್ತಾ ಹೋಗಿ ಕಲಿಸ್ತಾ ಹೋಗ್ಬೇಕು ಹಾಂ ಅದೇ ಬೇಕೋ ಬೇಡ ಅಂತೇಳಿ ಸೊ ಅದು ಫೀಲ್ ಇಂದ ಹಾಂ ಫೀಲ್ ಇಲ್ಲ ನಮಗೆ ಗೊತ್ತಾಗುತ್ತೆ ಅದು ಸೊ ನೋಡೋ ವರ್ಕ್ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಈಟಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ದಟ್ ಗೋಸ್ ಇನ್ ಟು ಮೇಕಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಜೋಳದ ರೊಟ್ಟಿ ಯು ಡೋಂಟ್ ರಿಯಲೈಸ್ ಇಟ್ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಆರ್ ರಿಲೇಷಿಂಗ್ ಇಟ್ ಸರ್ ಈಗ ನಾನು ನೀರು ಮಿಕ್ಸ್ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದ್ದೀನಿ process of this whole thing you yeah, haven't seen uh, it before no i'm not so i kind of understood what happens actually i'm tempted to go and try this now yeah and fantastic sure in some form it will it has to appear so you'll find some inspiration yeah. from the humble north karnataka jolada roti yeah. made by ravi ganachari here hi at basveshwar ganavli and you will probably find uh, some avatar of it in london yeah you know this are the little techniques when you know then you start getting it right and yeah. this is a kind of knowledge that is precious kripa getting basics right is what i think all all those who are interested in cooking should be focusing on right you need to understand how to do it you just want to beat it now he says odre odre chanaga lock aagutha roti harella box ಹೂರ್ಣ 
ಒಮ್ಮೊಮ್ಮೆ ಇದು ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಗೋಧಿ ಹಿಟ್ಟು ಮೈದಾ ಹಿಟ್ಟು ಮಿಕ್ಸ್ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ತರ್ಟಿ ಪರ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ಗೋಧಿ ಹಿಟ್ಟು ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಫಿಫ್ಟಿ ಪರ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ಮೈದಾ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಪರ್ಸೆಂಟ್ ರವ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಚರೋಟಿ ರವ ಹಾಂ ಸಾಫ್ಟ್ನೆಸ್ ಬರಲ್ಲ ಹಾಕಲಿಲ್ಲ ಸೆಮೋಲಿನ ಯಾ ಮೆನ್ ಯು ಡು ದೇ ಡು ಪೂರಿ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಎ ಲಿಟಲ್ ಸೆಮೋಲಿನ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ಇಟ್ ಕೀಪ್ಸ್ ದ ಕ್ರಿಸ್ಮಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ಲಾಂಗರ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಇನ್ ಎ ವೆರಿ ಸಟಲ್ ವೇ ಇಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಡಸ್ ದ ಸೇಮ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ ದೇ ಕಾಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಗರಿ ಗರಿ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಅದರಿಂದ ಹಾ ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಗರಿ ಗರಿ ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಗರಿ ಗರಿ ಬರುತ್ತೆ ಸೋ ದ ಲೋಕಲ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಫಾರ್ ಕ್ರಾಚ್ ಇಸ್ ಗರಿ ಗರಿ ಹಾ ಓಕೆ ಸೋ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ದೇ ಸೇ ಆರ್ ವಿ ಯೂಸಿಂಗ್ ತುಪ್ಪ ಗೀ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಆಯಿಲ್ ಮಿಕ್ಸ್ ಮಾಡುವಾಗ ಗೀ ಆ್ಯಡ್ ಮಾಡಿರ್ತೀವಿ ಸೊ ಇಲ್ಲಿನೂ ಗೀ ಒಂದು ತುಪ್ಪ ಮಿಕ್ಸ್ ಆಗುತ್ತೆ ಸೊ ತಿನ್ನುವಾಗ ಮಾತ್ರ ಗೀ ಬೇಕು ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಸ್ಪೈಸಿ ಬಟ್ ನಾಟ್ ದ ಸೂಪರ್ ಸ್ಪೈಸಿ ಹಾಂ ಎಕ್ದಮ್ ಸ್ಪೈಸಿ ತೊಗೊಂಡ್ಬಿಟ್ರೆ ಬ್ಲ್ಯಾಕ್ ಬರುತ್ತೆ ಸೊ ಅಡಿಗೆ ಕಲರ್ ಗ್ರೀನ್ ಬರಲ್ಲ ಐಜರ್ ಸೀಡ್ಸ್ ಹಾಂ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ದೇ ಮೇಕ್ ಅ ಚಟ್ನಿ ಔಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಟ್ ಪುಡಿ ಔಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಇಟ್ ಕಾಲ್ ದ ಗುರೇಳು ಸೊ ದೇರ್ಸ್ ಅ ಲಾಟ್ ಆಫ್ ದೀಸ್ ಕಾಂಡಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಯು ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ದ ಚಟ್ನಿ ಸೊ ಗುರೇಳು ದ ಶೇಂಗಾ ಪುಡಿ ದೆನ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ದೇರ್ಸ್ ಅ ಕೆಂಪು ಚಟ್ನಿ ಗುರೇಳು ತಿನ್ನು ನೋಡಿ ಏನಾಗಲ್ಲ ಇದು ಫ್ರೈ ಮಾ ಅಂದರೆ ಡ್ರೈ ಆಗಿ ಫ್ರೈ ಮಾಡಬೇಕು ಸ್ವಲ್ಪ ಸಾಲ್ಟ್ ಹಾಕಬೇಕು ನೈಸ್ ಆಮೇಲೆ ಇದನ್ನು ಚಟ್ನಿ ತಯಾರಿಸ್ಬೋದು ವೆರಿ ಫೈಬ್ರೆಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ದ ಚೂಯಿನ ಅಷ್ಟು ಸೊ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ಬಿಟ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ಬಿಟ್ ಹಸ್ಕಿ ಇನ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಟೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಜಾಬ್ ಎ ಸ್ಮಾಲ್ ಹಾಂ ನಾಟಿ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಸಂದೇ ಕಾಳು ಸೊ ಚೌಲಿ ಬಟ್ ಸ್ಮಾಲ್ ಸರ್ ಇದು ನಾಟಿ ಕಾಬುಲ್ ಚೆನ್ನ ಇದು ಈ ಕಡೆ ಈ ಕಡೆ ಕಾಬುಲ್ ಚೆನ್ನ ಇರ್ತಾರಲ್ಲ ನಾಟಿ ಇರುತ್ತೆ ಲೈಕ್ ನೇಟಿವ್ ಚಿಕ್ಕಿಂಡ್ there's some spicing that goes into it etc so that's a flour for that the pachi hasu mate chikki flour ha chikki flour so it's one is to one now one is to one sir one is to one same 50 50 oh matki mod bean yeah yeah light akun sir nati sir is nati ha they all small right yeah. they are not your usual big ones you see they have to work harder to extract the nutrient from the soil absolutely where the flavor then comes from correct right you know like yes sir 